What's up, everybody? I'm Rick. And I'm Anna. And welcome to our Q&A. Yay! <laughs> so, Anna, when we reached a thousand subscribers, uh, we told all of you that we were going to be doing a Q&A and ask you to uh, ask your questions uh, in the comments of our videos. And we have uh, taken all of these questions and we'll answer them in this video. Yes. <laughs> We've been asked, Anna, two questions. <laughs> two questions. <laughs> So we'll answer these two questions. And right, that's great. Yeah, thank you for those who ask questions. And thank you for anyone who watched the video. Uh, even if you didn't ask questions, it's it's all right. Uh, but yeah, we'll answer these two questions in as uh, much detail as possible. And maybe talk a bit about ourselves too, like just to, you know, Humor. let you guys know <laughs> <laughs> a bit more about us, which was the goal to begin with. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, let's uh, begin with our first question, Anna. Uh, it is Mr. Cool Attitude who asks, where are you two from? Where are you from, Anna? I'm from Romania. Proudly from Romania. Yeah? Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty much it. Uh, let me answer that. Maybe uh, I have a bit more of an eclectic uh, Yeah, you have more to say background. to that, like where yeah. you are from. Mm -hmm. So I'm uh, from Canada. Like if someone would ask me where I'm from, I would say I'm from Canada. I'm Canadian. Uh, but I was born in Venezuela, South America. Uh, I speak no Spanish and I've been <laughs> raised all my life in Canada. So like I, I never really answered that I'm from Venezuela. I would say I'm from Canada. The French part of Canada though, uh, Specifically Montreal and the oui, surrounding. Oui, je parle français. Un, deux, trois, quatre, omelette. So yeah, uh, that's why maybe some people, you know, they might perceive an accent on both of our part. Uh, even though. Oh yeah, I think I definitely have a foreign accent. <laughs> Mo Montreal, they speak both French and English. French was still my first uh, language, and yours is Romanian. Romanian. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, that's the answer. Basically, I'm from Canada. You're from Romania. Romania. Yeah. Uh, thank you for the question, Mr. Cool Attitude. <laughs> Keep your cool attitude. Um, next one, our last question. Yeah. <laughs> uh, from Valmir Augusto, who asks, "How did you meet each other?" And that's probably something that we can go on for a bit longer. Yeah, there's that's, a little bit of a story there. That's a story. So it all started back in 18... No. 2014. <laughs> yeah. It started in oh, 2014, I guess. Uh, let's do a bit of a background. We'll answer the straight answer and then do background on each of us and then meet in the middle, if okay. you see what I mean. Sure, uh, I so got it. So basically the answer is we met in Japan. Huh? But how did both of us get to Japan? That might be an interesting story. So why don't you start? How did you end up in Japan? Oh, so like if I have to like go back and start the story like this, I would say my story started when I was 10 years old. <laughs> 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 Literally. I've always wanted to go to Japan. And ever since I was a kid, I wasn't so much interested in all like, um, you know, the popular stuff about japan i was very interested in language mm. ever since i was a kid and i was watching anime obviously i always wanted to learn the language it just sounded amazing to me and i wanted to understand what they're saying and i wanted to be able to speak like that i just found it so i don't know interesting yeah um so having this dream like for most of my life i ended up studying japanese in the university in romania and I got a scholarship to study for one year in Japan to do an exchange student program. Um, and basically that is how you I get... ended up being in Japan, in Tokyo. Mm -hmm. um, and that's where I met you. Yeah, <laughs> and where did I came from? Where did so, you come from? Uh, as was previously established, I came from Canada uh, to Japan, but how did that happen? So maybe like you, ever since I was a kid, I had a... Uh, interest towards the land of the rising sun uh, interest that came from a, a bit everywhere you know be, be it music uh, anime manga uh, movies uh, old samurai movies that i would watch godzilla uh, mainly pop culture is how i got my introduction and then uh, culture in general is where i deepened my interest and so what happened is that when i went to university 
uh, I took a Japanese class in order to, you know, culture and language are deeply related. And so to understand the language, you need to understand the culture and vice versa. So I wanted to learn Japanese. So I took a Japanese class and the first class, someone came in and said, hey, you know that you have the uh, possibility to do a year abroad in Japan. Mm -hmm. And you were like, yeah. And I was like, hey, that's an idea. I'd like to do that. And so uh, I did what I had to do in order to get that done. I uh, sent my application and ended up also in a foreign, uh, as a foreign student in Tokyo, Japan. And uh, the same year that you were there. Right. And so this is same when we met. Same place. Because same we dorm. were <laughs> both in the same dorm, same uh, university. Uh, and the same country at the but same time. But you're doing different programs. Doing different right. programs, yeah, because yeah. I was mainly studying, uh, you know, history, politics, economics. Uh, I was in like a uh, Japanese language, language yeah. school. Yeah, I was doing social studies. You were doing language. Um, but still, we were in the same dorm. And yeah. uh, so more in detail of how exactly we met is basically that. We were in the dorm uh, and there was this dorm party and we just started right it was like the introduction party for yeah. all the, the i mean all the students there were new mm -hmm. uh, we, we we all just arrived there yeah um so the dorm um, manager organized this party for all of us to get to know each other to talk to each other you know so it, it was uh, everyone was there yeah and so we pretty much just hit it off uh, we talked to each other had fun some drinks and uh, for the rest of our uh, exchange student year in Japan, we were together most of the time, right? We yeah, it was a great year. It was it was amazing. Yeah. Uh, we did a lot of different activities together, mm -hmm. a lot of different uh, like uh, trips and uh, cultural discovery activities and all of that. So I think yeah. that that was like really good for us to mm -hmm. like to get to know each other and to see that we have very similar interests and curiosities. Yeah. Uh, this is actually uh, when the idea of making a YouTube channel came from. Uh, it was from you. Uh, yeah. I remember we had a conversation about that uh, while we were in Japan and you were saying like, oh, we should do that. And I was like... And mind you, I was not serious about it at all yeah. at that time. <laughs> or not that I wasn't serious, but it's not like I actually put thought into it. It was more like, hey, wouldn't it be cool if we could do that? Yeah. You know? And I was more like, eh, no, I don't really think so. <laughs> you yeah. don't, didn't want yeah. to do it at first. Uh, yeah, exactly. And look at us now. Uh, but the story doesn't end there, you know, after our year in Japan, we had to each had to go, go back to, to our, our countries, own countries. Right, because and we had to finish, uh, finish school. school. Mm -hmm. yeah. So we were split for uh, a while there, but I visited you uh, several times in Romania. You came to see me in Japan while I was there for an internship, I went back. Uh, and after, you know, finishing school uh, on both of our side, we ended up moving together here in Montreal. Yes. And this is where we are now. Yes. In Montreal. Montreal. <laughs> and uh, we've been here uh, together, married, actually, for uh, a couple of years doing yeah. these videos, uh, doing our bucket lists. Uh, I guess since we don't have any other questions, it'd be nice to also talk about how that bucket list uh, idea came about. Oh, like uh, from the beginning, the beginning? Yeah, yeah. So what we had like... Uh, uh, while well, we were separated, like several conversations about, like, oh, we should do this and we should do that. You know, people always have uh, crazy plans. Uh, and then when we got together, uh, or even before that, uh, I came up with the idea of, okay, we'll do a list, a specific right, list. Because you like lists yeah. so much. <laughs> yeah. And I'll come up with 50 things, you come up with 50 things, and then we'll put them together in yeah. a list of 100 things uh, that we want to achieve. Uh, which... In the end, a lot of the stuff overlapped. Right, so then we had to like bring out new ideas. Mm -hmm. But I think that's also how we kind of got the idea to like not actually stop at that, but have a continuous list. Continuous of, like, list, keep yeah. Keep adding new things. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But like the first version was ended up being 101 thing. Uh, and we weren't doing any videos about that. You know, it was definitely just for, for us, us yeah. things that we wanted to do. Even then, like in uh, 2019, we had started a YouTube channel. We were already doing the bucket list, but we also started a, a YouTube channel called In Our World, 
that was more about travel and yeah. uh, you know discoveries and like cultural uh, yeah. experiences things like this which we still do videos on that channel uh, but that was our first channel uh, and then in the fall of that same year we started this channel here uh, AR bucket list um, and as time went on you know we let go of some of the other channels there were also some other projects <laughs> we reduced all of this to just these two channel right uh, which I, I feel like they're the most important to us and they're mm -hmm. really uh, things that we want to do anyway yeah uh, things that like we've dreamed about for so long and we're excited about doing them yeah. so I say reduce to just these two channels. These two channels for the two of us. You also have your own personal channel. Yeah, right. Uh, about beauty product, uh, which recent. I'm not uh, part of. You're you're not familiar with that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, basically that is how we met and how we ended up uh, together here in uh, Montreal. And who knows what the future shall lead us, Anna? I wonder. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, that was basically it. Those were the two questions that we had. Maybe we'll do that again uh, in the future and maybe get some other questions <laughs> through that time. But thank you for the two person who asked their question, uh, Mr. Cool Attitude and Valmir Augusto. Uh, thank you for everybody who watched this video and uh, who are watching our other videos too. Uh, this has been uh, an incredible journey with all of you. And uh, I hope you continue to be there with us as we try to realize all of our goals and dreams that are on our bucket list. Uh, I will leave you with the entire bucket list uh, showing right after that. Hope you guys have a nice day. Bye bye. Come have fun with us and don't forget to subscribe!